In Snakes and Ladders, you have no free will. You're at the mercy of a single dice, and I love it. While I was looking up walkthroughs for Snakes and Ladders, I quickly learned that this game was made for preschoolers, which is probably why it's so simple. Or how about the game Sorry, which is the most unapologetic game I've ever played. There's some strategy- Oh wow, that's crazy. But most of the time, you're just getting revenge on the players who've wronged you. And the creators of Sorry knew this because the tagline of the game is, Sorry, the game of sweet revenge. Which, if you think about it, is a pretty funny- <laughs> That's how I am when I play Sorry. <laughs> Aha! Take this! Sorry. I know how to play chess, but like most things, I'm not very good at it. Unless I'm playing against someone under the age of four, I don't want to play that <laughs> game. Because it shows everyone how bad I am at planning ahead. That's a game that's 100% strategy based. It's like the IQ test of board